What is that? Cheese roll. Can I have a bite? Besides the point, welcome to my channel. Cute theme song. Welcome to my YouTube channel, strictly for girls like me who want to say find themselves find their confidence and be happy being unique I felt like I had to be weird or sorry felt like in order to be unique I, ha I was weird you don't want to have to do that you just be yourself and you say you know what take it or leave it I'm here notes from the wise I don't know it took a lot of guts to get up and buy my first camera. I'm filming on a Sony ZV-1. I think that's the name of it. I was going back and forth deciding whether or not I wanted to use my iPhone or if I wanted to invest in a nice camera. Well, I invested in a camera, um, but I also have a very good iPhone 14 Pro Max. No, sorry. 13 Pro Max. Okay, so anyways, today I need to go through my closet. I need to figure out what I need to get rid of because some of this stuff just doesn't belong. I've had it for years. It's sitting in there. It needs to go. So, today I'm going to take the privilege of getting rid of some of my items, trying on a few things, and seeing if they still fit because I gained weight during the pandemic. Example number one, I need to get rid of things. I need to put it in the Goodwill donation box so that way I can get 15% off my next purchase at Goodwill. And that way I can partake in thrifting and buying more things. Example number one. I don't know where I got this dress from. And I don't care. But I'm gonna try it on. Alright, here's the dress. And let's see if I can. Yeah, it doesn't fit. So. Well, I am kind of over trying on clothes. <laughs> I think I'm at a point now where it's like, okay, I'm ready to go to bed. It's around that time. Um, but yeah, I don't know. That was kind of fun. I don't know. I mean, maybe you should start doing this more often. Anyways. I'm at the point now where I'm very tired. <laughs> I had a very long day. Actually, um, I woke up this morning and got ready and went to my first, my first vocal lesson. Yes. I'm not much of a singer. Neither are my parents or anyone in my family. I would be the first one to sing or to have taken vocal lessons. And I was so nervous because I had never sung in front of anyone but myself in front of the shower or, sorry, <laughs> in the shower or in the car. So this was completely new for me. I went in there and I killed it because I came out, like literally at the end of it, the, the girl was just like, wow, you have a natural talent. And I was like, are you sure? <laughs> I, okay, so it's weird because I could hear myself and I could like hear my voice crack. I could hear all of these things. You know, my tone wasn't right. My like fluctuations were not there. So I was a little concerned because I was just like, I don't know if I have enough. I, my voice is really not all that. But thank you for the compliment. She was really like tooting my horn. Do people say that? I don't know. She was really tooting my horn. She was just like, wow, you are a great singer. Like... You know, most black women who come in here, they sing amazingly. And she's, she's from the Ukraine, so there's like a little bit of a language barrier. She's like, most black women who come in here, they sing. 
it's because you're African American. And I was like, <laughs> it's like, you're right, you know? <laughs> like, I naturally can sing. You're so right. I came home and like I showcased my 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 uh, my new skill and natural talent to my husband and he I don't know if he was impressed or not <laughs> but <laughs> I'm not a good singer and I'm not gonna sing for you guys please don't worry about it so today I had my first vocal lesson and I don't know I will be honest with you though I that is something that I wouldn't mind continuing to do and continuing to explore because you never know I could come out here and be a singer you guys do not know I hit those I hit those notes like it's nothing la, 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 that kind of thing and so I was doing it she's like you know the notes before I could play it on the piano and I was like yeah I feel like everyone knows the la 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 besides the point fun time um yeah it is Saturday. Um, we've made it back around the week. Here we are. It's about 7, 10, 17 a.m. Um, yeah, I am actually getting ready for my second singing lesson. I had my last one last week. It went pretty well, as the uh, instructor said. And so this week, I'm really excited. I'm like, okay, I'm ready. I'm going all in. So yes, this is Miss Pepper. Anything you want to say to the audience? You trying to go away? Okay. All right. All right. I'm putting you down. So my home screen says, "Fix your thoughts. Fix your thoughts." I have issues with anxiety and I constantly have to tell myself every day, fix your thoughts on what is true, what is honorable, what is right, and what is pure. And for those who know, that comes from Philippians 4.8. Um, I don't know, that's always been the verse that I've turned to um, ever since I was little and I used to have these really bad panic attacks. And my dad was just like, okay, think about this verse. Anytime you feel anxiety, anytime you feel like you're literally going to fall off the face of the earth, say these words and the God of peace will be with you. Um, and so ever since then, I would always just refer to this verse. It's just something good. And I think that's something that I'm going to take into my day and something you should take into yours. I want to talk about something that I think is kind of like, it's been on my mind constantly over the last couple of weeks or months. <laughs> um, I'm sure you guys have all heard of that term, that girl. What does it mean to be that girl? <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm just, I'm trying to figure that out. I don't know, everywhere I look on social media, TikTok, Lemonade, all of these apps, I'm seeing like posts of like, how to be that girl, or I'm that girl, and I'm just like, well, what makes you that girl? I look at these posts, and girls are posting of like, this is how you do your hair to be that girl, and I'm like, and it's weird because you have to follow what they're doing with their hair, and then you're like, oh, I've got my hair in a style now, with like, and now I'm that girl. You know, how, how you need to dress, how you need to have these nightly routines that consist of like using 18 different products, or how you need to wear a certain outfit to the gym. Although the gym is where you sweat and you get a little ugly, you're like, I for some reason need to put on like the best Lululemon outfit. So I think I want to talk about like the true definition of what it means to be that girl. I've struggled with it my whole life. And I think when I see these posts, I start to think like, okay, I now need to make a checklist in order to meet the, this, this protocol. It's crazy because I'm just like, why not just be yourself? 
And I think that's definitely, you know, one of the reasons why I wanted to start this channel was to really encourage people to be themselves and not conform to these norms. How can I make this trend my own? How can I be um, unique in every way possible? It's, it's, it's really discouraging, I think, to be a woman in this age. And it's just like, I don't know. I mean, I can't even eat the food I enjoy, man. I like burgers and fries and pizza and items that are unhealthy. <laughs> and, and then I look around and I see these girls eating like salads and like, you know, this is how I make my protein bowl smoothie. And I'm like, great, like I'm, I'm gonna just go get some acai once, you know, once every two months. And <laughs> maybe I'll try a little smoothie or so, but enjoy being you and enjoy the moment and like continue to show who you are because I think that's the biggest influence of all is being yourself. And if other people see it, then they will all be themselves. I feel like in order to be that girl, there is a certain level of confidence that you need. There is a cer certain level of claiming that I'm that girl, no matter if I don't fit the norm, but we shouldn't follow anybody. Like, just be you. Anyway, so that's the lesson from that girl. <laughs> Catch me next week on this girl's channel. That girl's channel. I don't know. Anyways, <laughs> let's go. I'm here at my singing lesson. I am like beyond nervous. And I know I shouldn't really be this nervous, but ah! I've been like on my way driving here. I've literally been singing in the car, like prepping myself. Cause I'm just like, okay, how is this going to pan out? I don't know. I didn't drink any water this morning. So <laughs> I don't have any water in the car. So I'm just like, I don't know what to do. I'm so nervous. <laughs> Y'all don't understand. But anyways, I will update you guys afterwards, but I am so nervous. Like my voice has been cracking. Um, I was trying to practice while I was driving and it was just not really working. So, um, Wish me luck. Catch you on the flip side. Oh. I just finished my singing lesson. And I don't know, man. Like, it just felt so weird. Like, I feel exposed. I don't know. I feel like I've literally been placed naked in front of an audience and, and I was told to sing. It just felt so weird. I don't know. The entire time my voice kept cracking. I told you guys it was going to happen. I told you <laughs> that my voice was just going to continue to crack. And it did. She gave me a water bottle. She was like, here you go. You need it. I was like, girl, yes. Because, mm -mm. It's a tough world in the singing industry. How do they do that? Oh my gosh. The only level of singing that I've ever done was like kids choir at church and yeah and I sucked at that I like yelled the whole time I was like one of those kids that was like Jesus I wasn't even really singing I was just screaming anyways so I told her I was like okay I have like some volume in my voice and she's like okay well you know pick a song that you can sing for me right now and like put your whole heart into it so in the moment, I didn't really know what to choose, but I ended up choosing like a Paramore song. And she was like, I don't think this is your type of song. I think it's a little too bland for your voice. And I was like, hmm, I'll take that as a compliment. And it's also a jab to Paramore, but like, <laughs> I was like, okay. And she was like, I really feel like I can see you um, singing like Beyonce or Whitney Houston or Christina Aguilera because she said that I had that powerful of a voice and I was like all right um but I didn't know what song to choose so I ended up choosing um a song by Lauren Daigle called uh You Say which is a really good song I love it and like that's just one of those songs that I listen to on the daily um it's weird because there's like a family next to me getting into their car and they're looking at me weird because I have a camera on my dashboard I'm just gonna pretend like I'm on my phone. Oh, look at that.
with that, Amazon cancels two more first season shows despite previous renewals. So, just gonna look at the news. Okay, the family has left. They didn't leave yet. Okay. Okay, they're gone. Hi. Um. Why are there so many people right now in Glendale? Like, don't be here. Um, anyway, so, I don't know. Anyways, what was I gonna do? Uh, so, I just got back from a super long day doing a lot of errands. I literally spent four hours in TJ Maxx and I went through the entire store. I got like a bag of clothes, so I went kinda crazy at the store. Um, but as you know, I am trying to redo my closet, so of course, you gotta do what you gotta do. I wanted to take you guys with me, but of course my camera dies. <laughs> so I was at the end of my, I had just finished my singing lesson and my camera died. So, um, and I just decided, I was like, you know what, let me just go and get this done with. So I ended up going to TJ Maxx. I went, I got a bite to eat. Um, but anyways, I just thought I'd close out this vlog and um, let you guys know that I spent in the the triple digits at uh, TJ Maxx and I also went to Ulta and I spent like in the triple digits there so there's my paycheck um, <laughs> but anyways I digress um, I'm probably gonna read a little bit tonight before I go to bed and um, I'm about to close out this vlog thanks for watching and don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, follow me everywhere. Hi. Be yourself. Don't let anyone tell you different. Don't let anyone put you down. And don't break your back trying to please everyone else because no one said you really had to do that.